As you now know, there are five parts of the Earth system. Each part has its own collection of materials and processes. However, the parts of the Earth system do not operate on their own. They all interact with the other parts in many ways. The atmosphere extends up from the Earth's surface for several hundred kilometers. It contains all of the air in Earth's system. The atmosphere is composed of a number of layers. One example of how this layer protects us is the stratosphere. The stratosphere protects the organisms in the biosphere from the sun's ultraviolet radiation. The biosphere is all living things, from single-cell bacteria to plants, animals, and humans. The biosphere has a great impact on the climate because the biosphere is closely connected to the atmosphere, where plants harness the sun's energy through photosynthesis. Oxygen is released into the atmosphere and carbon dioxide is taken out. The geosphere includes all minerals, rocks, molten rock, sediments, and soils. While the stuff that rocks are made from stays the same, the rocks do not. Over millions of years, rocks are recycled into other rocks. Moving tectonic plates help to destroy and form many types of rocks. The hydrosphere includes the oceans, rivers, lakes, streams, and groundwater. About 70% of the Earth's surface is covered with water, and most of that is the ocean. Only a small portion of Earth's water is freshwater, which is found in rivers, lakes, and groundwater. Freshwater is needed for drinking, farming, and washing. The cryosphere is the frozen part of the Earth system and includes snow, glaciers, and sea ice. Approximately three quarters of the world's fresh water is frozen in the cryosphere. The sun has a large impact on the Earth, and so it's also considered a part of the Earth system. Almost all of the energy on Earth comes from the sun. The factors outside the planet, like the sun and solar system, which have an impact on the Earth system, are called the exosphere. Fun fact! The Earth's atmosphere is composed mainly of nitrogen, oxygen, argon, and carbon dioxide. 